YouTube. I will be showing you how to play NES games, Nintendo Entertainment System, on your Mac using an emulator. Alright, first we want to go to um, osxdaily.com. I'll have the link in the description. Alright, you want to go down here and scroll down until you get to uh, right here. You want to get right there. Download. It will download. And it um, it will end up as a DMG file. I've already downloaded it as you can see. So now let's make sure to see if it's in my trash. Alright. Okay. So once you do that, well, I'll go ahead and download it so you can see it. Because it makes everything easier. See? It'll only take a minute. Alright, while you're doing that, th this is for Mac. When you're doing that while it's downloading, go to doperoms.com. I'll have that also in the description. And you want to go down to ROMs and go to Nintendo NES. And here they have all different kinds of games. Uh, let's download Contra. So once you click on it, you go down and you click on what game you want. So download. You click on and then you scroll down and you click download. And you scroll down and you click on download again. Take you to the download link. So let's go up here. Minimize this. That's downloading. Alright, also while that's downloading, you want to go ahead and create um, a folder and name it whatever, but I wanted to name mine NES Games. Just keep that on your desktop. All right. So while I'm waiting, I want to create another file because I have multiple emulators. So you don't have to do this. I'm just going to do this for my own thing. Emulators. All right. So let's go ahead and here and let's go ahead and drag that in there. Where else I need to go? Alright, well, we got that done. So there's our Contra. But here, we need to go here to show and Finder. And then you can do what you want with it. But let's just click on it and it will open. And you got this. I am not sure what this is. As you can see. So, as you can see. I have no idea, but here is the actual emulator. So what you want to do is you want to drag that into your emulators, but I've already done that. So I'm just going to delete this. I've already done all that. Okay. So now let's just take the game you downloaded. And this stuff doesn't take up very much memory. Alright, so it's in there. So we're all good now. So I... So when we go into here, click that. All right, let's go into our. Let's go into here and let's go and. Oh man, did I just delete it? Oh, good thing I still. Good thing I had that in the trash. Let's drag it out. All right. Sorry about that inconvenience. Alright, let's click on it. It opens. So I'm going to drag this into my emulator's file. Let's get rid of that. This. Just uh, delete that. Alright. Let's go into here and then we go into our thing. Our Nestopedia. Click open. 
Alright, get out of that. Alright, it'll take you to documents. Now, you, your NES games file that you created. You want to go to your user. You want to go to desktop. We want to go to the file that we made. NES games. There's our game. Alright, so I'm going to click open. And there we go. There we go, so in Thank you, subscribe, like my other videos, thank you for watching.